Hello guys, this is Kazar bringing you another replay. This time we're playing in the Indian Panzer. I'm platooned up with... And I hope I will pronounce this correctly. Ovamiezu. And uh, who plays at E34 to get some credits. We're playing on Fisherman's Bay, so two, two replays from Fisherman's Bay. But this is quite a strong game that I had a few days ago. Because roughly all of my footage before, well not footage, all of my good games before this were well, either the Centurion or the 110. I don't want to spam you with a single tank, you know. Now, like next week, I can I can send a Centurion 71 uh, 7 1 uh, game and maybe something else. We'll see how how much good games I will get in the meantime. So Indian Panzer, not fully upgraded. I don't have the radio. Uh, the radio. Yeah, the radio and uh, engine. I don't have the top engine for this thing because there's no sense, honestly. If you want to get the Leopard 1 as fast as possible, you should not... You should not research this tank fully because a stock Leopard prototype has everything that this tank has already. Uh, there's no upgrades. So, yeah, you're just spending 30,000 experience for nothing. So we started the game with a shot on uh, Cromwell, lighting up him on fire, and AKV-1S I think killed him off, yep, AKV-1S killed him off. I'm just trying to walk this ridge line. I was quite confident that this game was gonna be a lose, I had a very very bad day. I lost most of my games and only when I started playing with Ova I actually started winning something, we, we pulled off a positive win ratio in the three hours of four that I played having difficulties to get the top, uh, not the top gun, uh, the difficulties to get the promotion 300,000 credits now I get hit by the target too which puts me like a little bit wondering because I didn't spot him but I shoot the Indian Panzer now falling back but there's the King Tiger, he's on C1 right beside the Indian Panzer so my spotting range has failed a little bit now I'm trying to go around and maybe get some shots and I get hit again with that kind of damage that King Tiger was looking at me again. So he was looking at this ridge line waiting for me because I shouldn't be spotted by the moment I was going forward. But hell. The spotting in this game is really broken so nothing to do about that. We won the city we can see. But honestly in the city there were only a Yak Panther, a T29, a Ferdinand, and that's it. So there was nothing over there, everything's over here or charging up the middle. So I'm waiting. Indian Panzer kills uh, our Pershing. Now we, it's looking a little bit more dreadful for us. 3 to 5. And you're gonna see this is gonna be a very, very clutch game. One of my best, well, my best game in the Indian Panzer, and still not a mastery city. It seems I have just a little bit of, uh, you know, I'm unlucky in the sense of getting mastery scores. I had a great game in the FV4202, done four and a half thousand damage, and I still didn't get the mastery. 1.3 thousand above, almost 1.4 thousand uh, experience with a tier 10. It, roughly for the FV, it's enough. From what I saw, Quickie Baby got his ace tanker like in that range, so it should be good. But I probably lacked up about a hundred experience, if, if even not less. That game is also going to be up on YouTube, uh, maybe next week. And the same here, you're going to see how much experience I got for this game, and you understand why I'm being a little bit angry about it. Now the King Tiger is going for the for rip, you know securing the capture. I'm just. Looking around, can I get a shot? Yep. You can see the shells fly quite a long while. The muzzle velocity of the 90 mil is quite long. Now, King King Tiger's side armor. What not to love? And may maybe I f have the feeling that the shells are flying slower because I'm. Now I'm playing a lot of with the British still, and I'm used to APCR ammunition. Ova is saying he's gonna go protect the base, we are 6 to 8. 
with the enemy quite strongly like destroying everything in our team. I'm just getting side shots on the King Tiger. No problem whatsoever. This shot, yeah, this shot bounces and I was like, what? But honestly, I think I hit uh, like a very sloped part of the top armor of his uh, hull. Now spotting, of course, fails me. So I back out, I see Indian Panzer, Indian Panzer, Yak Panzer 4 coming around our base and only RT there to stop him. There's four guys in the game left. Me over, a Tiger 2 and the M12 against 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 tanks. Oh, there's our Indian Panzer. I'm just looking for him. Boom, penetrating head. Reloading, waiting for him to stand there. Oh no, he started moving. I shoot, but you you saw the shot went wide uh, in the right corner of the uh, circle. So unfortunately, the the biggest downside of German medium tanks, I feel, is the aim time. Now a properly lit shot that gave me a kill on that guy. Another shot right on top of the tiger. I was lucky that I didn't hit our tiger, killing the other Indian Panzer. Now a shot from 520 meters. Exactly into the act panzer killing him Again lead the shot not a kill five kills two thousand damage And guys, this is just half of the game believe me What's gonna happen here is I I don't understand it. I'm just saying to over like Please come over here and try to support me Because if something comes around this corner, I will be this. He's saying like it's a win and I'm still not confident. I know that the Indian Panzer is just too fluffy to To bounce a lot of shells, so I cannot rely on my health or my armor I have to rely on the surprise factor and honestly with this kind of spotting that I get with this tank There's not a lot of surprise factor for me I'm the one being surprised and you're gonna see that in a second I'm just waiting for maybe something to spot. Oh, it's quite high on life. There we go, we see the low rear. The RT, but unfortunately he makes it to that ridge line in time, so I cannot shoot him. I don't know if I got spotted, I didn't notice. And I don't have six cents on this, so... I think I don't. Yeah, I don't, I have repair crew. And that RT is gonna stay there for quite a long time. Ova is going back to kill it. In retrospection, that was a bad idea. And look, I just see a King Tiger going right behind me. I get shot in the back. I put a hit in him, but it's not an exchange when I am two hits away from dying. We have roughly a second, mo he has a second more reload time. And he does a hundred damage more than I do. So I put one hit into him again, tracking him probably. Ova shoots him, but I didn't track him, I shoot him again, now I tracked him, he tracks me, and my tracks repair fast enough so I can get out of that sticky situation, but I'm at 300 life, 6 kills giving me top gun, we killed a king tiger, but we have 2 other tanks left, there's a ALR44, which... I knew that Joke was saying very highly of this tank, so I was a little bit scared of it. I put a shot in the FV. But he doesn't have the Top Gun, he doesn't have the 88mm or... Or the coins. And I get hit. Now I notice where, where, I, where he saw me, but he didn't penetrate. I tried to get a shot on the RT, but... He's running away and overkills him before I get a shot. Probably if I kill that arty a little bit before I would get I would get the uh, ace tanker in this. I bounce a shot from the VK and he, unfortunately I bounce a shot on the VK at the same time. It's I miss a shot, he bounces a shot. Over bounces. He was so pissed at this point, he shot him two times with the T-34. And as he's saying, they dinged us. 
and this VK will be stupid enough to, to show his side again and they will he will bounce again fortunately for me I didn't bounce tracked him he started using gold but he's only damaging my tracks I do a stupid thing I shoot him in the gun mantlet instead and now you saw that we dinged him that was over and I shoot him again now thinking like okay I bounced him off means he's probably not able to penetrate me so let's just kill him let's just look you can see he was shooting me at the tracks trying to immobilize me I got hit once in the commander's hatch once in the gun mantlet and once in the lo lower plate those two shots were gold but the T28 prototype is like oh my god Indian nice and I'm still like I don't know what's happening with this game now we just come around the corner looking for the ALR and there he is we spotted him going around the corner now I see his huge ass but he hides I think okay yeah now I'm gonna get you hiding behind this little building telling all that like come in come in just allow him to shoot I load premium ammo the other shot was also a premium shell just to secure the win and we kill him so let's look at the end place for this game guys so here we have the first plate for this game we earned 2005 experience and um, inaccurate saying 300 is uh, 369,394 credits first class uh, mastery barge Riley Waters medal, steel wall medal, top gun medal and sniper with 26 hits out, 90 hits, uh, with 29 hits out, 26 hit, that's 90% uh, hit ratio, that's why we got so good scores. Now, let's look at the second plate. At the second plate, we can see I got 4,419 damage, over I got 2,200, and roughly, except for us, there were only two guys that exceeded 1,000 the IS 6 and the Tiger 2, which I think it's as easy as it can be t for them to do. Above a thousand damage, honestly, it's oh, sorry, only three or four hits. But yeah, it allowed for a great game for us. Uh, on the other team, we can see six people were exceeded a thousand, but no one exceeded two thousand. So the, the their team like played decently, but nothing impressive. So let's look at the uh, last plate. At the last plate, we see twenty. As I said, twenty nine shots out, twenty six direct hits, twenty two penetrations, four thousand four hundred damage. I received 12 hits with 8 penetration and 4 non-penetration hits, obvious, 8 plus 4 is 12, with a potential damage of 2755 that didn't kill me, because the Indian Panzer can be bouncy at times. I spotted one enemy, I did damage upon spotting 547, so yeah, that's uh, what basically happened, and you can see on the credits page that we got 53,000 uh, credits without counting the events because there was one event that I actually fulfilled with this game it was the 300,000 credits for 30 kills per day plus the Indian Panzer is right now on the like you know the King of the Hill series so the Indian Panzer, the Leopard 1, the Leopard Prototype and the Leopard 1 are on promotion, they receive 30% more income, so I received 16,000 more from what, what, what would I receive, so I received 340,000 for this game, which is quite strong. So yeah, that was the game, I hope you enjoyed it guys, and I'll see you guys next time.